on her for her reaction, but it's kind of Kay. understandable. <laughs> I feel like. Fig, wait! Come back, Fig! I'm sorry, I didn't mean it! Fig! Aww. Yeah, it's a lot to process to find out that you're actually a fascist and that everything um, you've ever you, believed that, is wrong. And that you were a forgotten baby? <laughs> Yeah. You were a forgotten baby. <laughs> and Jesus. <coughs> it's hard to to process that not only were you a part of a massive murder scheme, it's like how do you process that? And then she goes through everything she's ever like felt, including, you know, thinking forgotlings are beneath her and shit. And I think she knows that's not true, but she was just saying it because there's just so much mm -hmm. that she has to think about. And I think she knows it's not Fig's fault, but I think she was projecting a lot of it onto her father figure. Mm -hmm. What's his face? Bonku. Bonku. I think she was definitely projecting that onto Bonk from Bonku onto Fig. Because <laughs> she feels like she's been used by everybody, and it's kind of true. Yeah. Like, how do you process that? Are we the baddies? <gasps> Are we gonna take everyone's soul and take over dad's house? What's happening? What is this? <gasps> Oof! <coughs> Does Banku know about this place? The real question is, what's Banku's deal? I don't know, pa Patro Patroclus? Patroclus and Achilles. Okay. How many other forgotten people are around, I wonder? Like, in the b world building term, is at least. I have a feeling that Banku was that homeless guy that everyone was ignoring at the beginning of the game. I don't know about Anne, though. He must have found Anne or something. Is it supposed to be that top one maybe to the left and then that middle one to the top? I know what I need to do. Oh. I know. I just need to figure out how to get there. Does that make sense? Mm-hmm.
Okay, I need to get this one here. Alright, that one there. This one here. And this one here. See how I have to like do it in a certain order? So I just need to think about this for a second. I'm glad you know how these puzzles work because I'm so confused. I just remind myself not to get stressed out and not worry about it. And then I'm able to do it. But then I get performance anxiety. What? Was this the secret door the whole time? This can't be real. Can you feel the grass? Okay. The wind on your face. Can you hear the leaves? Do you smell the dew? Do you smell you the dew? You might find it <laughs> Mountain overwhelming. Dew? Your kind consider this a place of serenity. Who are you? I am the first to be forgotten. The oldest thought and earliest memory. You are wondering in a memory of the place you call the ether. The crystals in this cave show the memories they keep. Okay. Well, it's beautiful here. <gasps> For godlings left what was once their home, and they long to return. But you have never known anything else. The ether was never yours to remember. I don't understand. What do you want from me? Whoa. Ooh. Big girl. Your kind are always searching for the new. Hunting it wherever you see it. What you catch is an illusion, so you search again, never resting. You leave behind an ocean of possessions to be forgotten. Is this anti-consumerism? Mm -hmm. I think so. Sure sounds like it. Sounds like, you motherfuckers keep making new shit. You keep just buying things. <laughs> and I'm like, yeah I do, I'm sorry. Now buy Forgotten N on limited release <laughs> Blu-ray. And you're like, what? Does this remind anyone of the Dark Crystal? Yeah, a little bit. Dark Crystal scared the butt off of me when I was a kid. And watch it as an adult, still scary. <laughs> Jim Henson, what the fuck? Forgetting is easy. As the new arrives, the old depart. Where does it go? Your time still void with impulses of the new. <laughs> One cannot blame the tree for growing, or the tide for rising. The bird building a nest eats only the twigs it needs. Stop making yeah. trash. Stop making garbage. And then oppressing the garbage. Mm -hmm. 
Is this the story of one girl who finds out that she's trash? We're all trash people. Trash people. Trash people. Look like trash. Talk act like, like people. But still act like trash. Mm -hmm. Whoop. Okay, now I'm my, I am my reflection. Okay. Mm. And my reflection's gone. Oh, wait. Here we go. You hope the game calls out capitalism and not just creation. I didn't say that. In that this was world Jeff. and the other. Creations made to last generations. Bonku displayed unique examples of his beautiful handcraft. But the world has moved on. What was he to do? He screamed and he cursed. He clung to a world that no longer valued him or his talent. Oof. Bonku formed a wish and disappeared inside it until it became true. One day, everyone was truly gone, and so was he. As he realized where he was, the thought of going back became all-consuming. He immediately forgot the hardships of the other world. A strange hunger grew in him as he devised a way to return. But his accomplishment will lead to his demise. You mean the Ether Bridge? There must be a way to save Bonku. Bonku has planted you here, and your roots are his. You need to make a choice. What choice? Chad is saying this feels especially potent considering all the panic buying that's been happening. <laughs> Oh god, now my I am my reflection. Who is the girl I see staring straight back, back at, at me? When will my reflection tear down the chains of consumerism? Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, what? What? This is why they cut the songs from the Mulan movie. <laughs> me of the game brain. Okay. Wow. Oh, okay. Please you update. don't know your own story, but these crystals remember. Okay. Hey, chat, can you hear us okay? Oh, yeah, you can. Wait! Don't come back until it's gone. If you don't want to be... Yeah. You gotta take responsibility. This will keep you warm. Someone will find you here. What? You, Please you, forgive me. You could have taken her to the fire station, not like a river. Don't go. Oh. 
I feel like maybe there were other options than leaving her in the river like Moses. <gasps> maybe she's supposed to be Moses Why who are leads you her people. Me this? Your past uh, is yeah. who you are. Why would you give me all this and then take it away? Yeah, maybe. I know you're not familiar with Jesus stuff. Um, I'm familiar with the Prince of Egypt movie. Okay, so in the movie, The Prince of Egypt, which this <laughs> is a recreation of. Yes. Um, I was like, at first I was like, why is she living, leaving her child in a river? You could have taken her to the orphanage. No, like, remember the part at the end where he like goes up to the scene and he's like, <laughs> Yeah, I have a feeling. you see all the fish that, and so, whales. So remember like in the movie, The Prince of Egypt, which has nothing to do with the Bible? <laughs> yeah, which is not recreated from any other story. It's a completely <laughs> unique. It's a completely unique Disney IP, movie. And, and original IP. <laughs> yeah, so... <laughs> Prince Moses was a prince, but he didn't know that he was Jewish, and finds out, like, okay, I'm Jewish, I gotta set my people free. She didn't know she was a forgotling. Yeah. She was left in a river, found by some douchebag, finds out she's a forgotling. So, I'm so glad that Prince of Egypt <laughs> caught me the symbolism behind this story. Yeah, not the Bible or anything. The movie Prince of Egypt. <laughs> I wonder if we're going to part a sea of crystals or something. That's how I learned a bunch of the Egyptian gods and goddesses, too. Oh, it's not a Disney movie? What oh. is it? it? I don't pro Probably, like, an animated... One of those animated movies that, like, maybe everybody associates with Disney. Yeah, it just looks like a Disney movie. I'm going to respond with Sorrow. Yeah. Oh, it's DreamWorks. Dude, she just cried exactly like a Studio Ghibli character. It was like the signature Studio Ghibli tear. Yeah. Like a big fat tear going down a certain way, and you're like, that's a Studio Ghibli cry. Whoa. Oh, whoa. 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 Can I jump? No. Oh. Okay. Oh, I'm. Okay. Can't. Okay. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> Dear diary, I went into some sort of crystal world. Dear diary, do you do the do? <laughs> this is a wild level. right now because yeah. I'm interested in how this is all coming together. She was forgotten because the title says made to chat. That's the name of the of the game. They said it. They said the name of the game. Oh, here we go. Here we go. See, and then jump. Maybe I can like sit here. Ah. <laughs> I have to like collect all of the movements. Collect all the Anne's. We're gonna remember Anne. You know what was really <laughs> driving me crazy though? Is that Crouch. Maybe if I jump off. Hmm. I don't know that we have to collect all of them though, because there's another one that we didn't collect. Yeah. Or maybe we're just doing them in. in, in there's a certain order. Oh, I think I almost had it. Whatever. 
catch them all. I watch a former South Korean Navy SEAL play Call of Duty. Uh, I appreciate your efforts playing with a controller. Uh, hmm. <laughs> Anne needs Mufasa to come tell her to remember who she is. Remember who you are. Alright, I don't know how to make this movement at all. Oh. Oh, okay. Interesting. So Wait, I, are you supposed to go through that door? There was no door. Oh. I just flicked a switch somewhere. Oh, okay. Yeah, see? Got it. Okay. So I think we just have to figure out how to make all these movements. Uh, I'll figure that out eventually. Jump! Like, I need to find a way to make this position. Can you jump from there? No. I'm gonna try. Because I've jumped. See, if you just jump like that, you have to jump from a hall at high distance. Jump! Jump! Explore a little bit. <sighs> ah. That's where we started off with. Yeah. <coughs> I think yeah. you have to do it from a certain height so she doesn't roll and just lands on her feet. I've tried that too, but we can try again. See? Yeah, because she doesn't... I just... Mm. Yeah. Two Bagel says, This feels like one of those game things where it ends up being so frustratingly simple to complete that you end up slightly annoyed. <gasps> I did it! And it's not... Hi, two bagels. I'll come back to it. Like, how do I do this one? That looks like... She's tripping. Are there any other ones? Well, maybe I can jump from this thing mm -hmm. and, like, jump. Oh. Here we go. Okay. Oh. Okay. Maybe if I do it again in a different way, like I jump where I'm supposed to? I don't know. So there's one left, and it's this one. Can you... <laughs> I'm gonna die. You have to do it the opposite way, like you did for the switch pose. What? No, you have to do it exactly how it says. Oh, I I think that what they're saying is like 
remember with the switch, like, we did something that, like, looked like it would have put you in the opposite position, but... What? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I did. And our time together is running out. I have so many questions. Where is my mother? The only question you need to ask is... What does your heart desire? I want to meet my mother. Fuck Bonku. I want to tell her. My mother needs to know that I'm alright. I have to meet her Wait, now. no, I just want to tell I'm her to go fuck sure herself. I'm not you can. What do you expect me to do? This is the oldest part of the caves. This is where the world of the Forgotten began. Here stood the cornerstone. The most concentrated anima crystal in the realm. But it was stolen. Panku. Inside the cornerstone was the heart of this world. The Arca. Bonku ripped it out and split it in two. One for you and one for him. That kept you from crystallizing. He will need both halves of the Arca to power the ether bridge. If he succeeds, this world will come to an end. Godlings and Fig. That's right. Our world yeah. cannot exist without the Arca. I will go to the tower and speak to Bonk. He will listen to me. No, he won't. Where you belong is a choice you need to make. But you will not have to make it alone. was right about the stone being from the heart of the world. Yep, if emissary. So she wants us dead. Yeah, well, we lived way past our owed time. Our so. expiration date? Yeah. We stole other people's time, so mm -hmm. I guess we just gotta die. It's fine. No big deal. I need a rest. Wait, now? Yeah, sleep in the boat. Okay. <laughs> Is she one of those people who can just nap and it's fine? Oh my god. Like, they can I, just nap it. She's just, she's just gonna, she's just gonna nap and she's fine? Um, you do that too sometimes. Yeah, not voluntarily. Mm. <laughs> it just happens. I forgive you. Oh, she's in the boat again. Get it? Oh. This kind of reminds me... Spoilers for the ancient mages is bride. This girl's like trying to figure out why her mom did something to her and then she's gifted with the reason why her mom did something to her and she's like I understand why you did it, but I don't forgive you mm -hmm. and Like she's able to find peace from that Because she had such a miserable life because her mom like did something really fucked up But why in the boat of all places? Yeah, I, th I agree with two bagels that the beach, you don't want to sleep on sand. It's it's poetic to sleep in the boat when she was left in the She's, boat yeah. on a cold day. <laughs> it seems like she went to two places and it was like, you know what? You're going in the river. Mm -hmm. You're like, wait, you can go to the police station or something. Also, nobody wants to sleep on the sand. I mean, sometimes, if you have a beach towel, it's doable. No. Yeah. I No, because it's windy, and then the sand just, like, gets what all over What if it's not windy? When is it ever not windy? At the beach? A lot of the time. No, it's always windy at the beach. My family's from Hawaii, so I spent a lot of time on the beach, and it was just fine. Yeah. I guess, It like, wasn't bothersome to me. Yeah. Whenever I've been, it's always just windy, and sand gets everywhere. Well, in Hawaii, where everything's perfect all the time, it's fine. How long are we gonna be napping here? Do I need to press buttons? Nope. We're just we're just vibing. Okay. <laughs> if I didn't have anyone to talk to during this segment, I'd be like, "Am I doing something wrong?" I know. 
Are we supposed to relax? Am I supposed to nap? <laughs> no, don't quote Star Wars. <laughs> Vibe check. I'd be too scared of toppling the boat because I roll around too much. I always envy people who can just lay down and sleep. Yeah. I usually, it takes me like, it'll either take me five seconds to fall asleep or two hours. There, it's, I, I don't know why. I just have a very hard time sleeping, like, aside from, like, midnight. It's very hard for me to sleep during the middle of the day. Unless I was already asleep and it's just, like, sleeping right through it. That I can do. Ooh, right through the day? Yeah. Wake That's up a good day. Roll out of bed 4 p.m.? Yeah. Mm. Mm. That's allowed now. <laughs> you can do that. No one can judge you for it because they'll never know. Did you get that TikTok I sent you? Mm-hmm. <laughs> the one where she's like, I'm going to go for a jog. Now, I'm dying. <laughs> okay, well, goodbye. <gasps> oh, no. Uh-oh. It's Jinx. Is she dying? No, no. What happened here? Um... Sowing what you reaped? Set my people free! It's the centerpiece from the <laughs> ceiling. What happened up there? Oh, Dude, boy. that's a dead body. Don't call it a centerpiece. Like, you know full well that's a giant dead body. My archer doesn't work <laughs> and I can't... Oh, okay. This is fine. Another one. Oh, you feel bad now? Mm. Okay. <gasps> and why are you surprised that people oh, are I dead? Forgot links. This was like literally your dude's plan this whole time. You were like, why do the Forgotlings not like it when I press them? I don't get it. Oh, they're dead. Who would do such a thing? <laughs> you! Yeah, me to chat's like, people will die. It's and completely and destroyed. And that's just like, people are dead? <laughs> <laughs> Mannequin was like, we have to go protect the people. She's like, no. I need to, like, go be dramatic. And he's like, okay, whatever. <laughs> Wait a second. Forgotlings are people? Okay, where am I going? Uh. Oh, I guess now she cares because she knows she's a forgotling. Ugh, what a terrible reason to give a shit. <gasps> Blanket! You, what are you doing here? Get out! Wait! <gasps> this is all your fault. He'd never have found us if it wasn't for you. No, I, I came here to- Leave! Boyfriend's dead? You don't belong here. Leave us alone. Dude, Get true love's kiss, right please. Now. Oh, Anne. I'm so sorry. You don't mean... Fig. Not you two. Shouldn't they be crystallizing? I'm sorry, Fig. Do not say no. another word. Because they were distilled. I didn't mean uh, to. Oh, fuck. You alone are responsible for this enforcer. This is where all your actions have led us. You're right. No, Anne. He's right. It's all my fault. <laughs> Bro, true love's kiss or some shit. I don't know. What's happening? Oh, hell yeah. A what? Whoa. Is this like in Pokemon the movie where the tears of all the Pokemon bring Ash back to life? <laughs> Is it? <laughs> and yet again, horniness brings him back to life. What did you do to him? Put that Arca down. Show some respect, girl. Where's Anne? 
Yay! Impossible! Fig? What did you do to me? I don't know. I was gone. I'm so sorry, Fig. I guess a stupid soulless thing like myself will have to settle for that. Oof. I don't believe it. You think I'd leave you in charge, Bob? And what happened after I left? Uh, well, <laughs> I went uh, to the world soul and she like told me I was trash, but it's good to be trash, but trash is bad. The short version, I walked into a cave. I met a spirit in there, and she changed my arc of And she told me Amazon she told me is she bad. She was the <laughs> first memory. She also told me that if Bonky turns on the ether bridge, the world will cease to exist. Well, she met a spirit in a crystal cave. Don't start. She <laughs> met the caretaker. There's no question about it. It's the only explanation for all of this. The caretaker doesn't exist. A spirit in a cave? A first memory? One who just happened to give Anne the ability to revive forgotlings? I don't care. But if our Arca can revive distilled forgotlings, I'm afraid we do need our help. What do you say, Enforcer? Should we set aside our differences? Yes. Get locked. Yeah, let's do it. Let's, let's do make it. out. Wonderful. The first thing we need <laughs> to... I'm joining Fig. Does that mean I you know. and Fig are going to spit well, roast me? Well, I guess me? that's better than nothing. I have a plan, and as much as I hate to admit it, we need your help, Enforcer. Anne. I'm doing this so no Forgotling will ever be distilled or hurt again. I couldn't have put it better myself, Anne. Okay, someone's saying bu Vic, Bulb needs why to chill. Are you staring at me? He cannot no chill. Reason. He's a Bulb. There are a lot of distilled Forgotlings outside. I better get to work. When you're done, let's meet in the hall and discuss our plan of attack. I like how they only had a funeral service for him and they just left everyone else's dead body to just do whatever. Come on, back alive! I'm finished! The still! Not anymore. I'm not? You're right. I'm not. Thank you. So I kind of like the message that instead of like trying to get back to a world that no longer technically exists the way you remember it that you can make peace with where you are now oh we have to charge our arca okay oh from where i don't know we'll have to figure it out Uwu Mania says, I'm kind of mad that Anne only cares about the Forgotlings now that she knows that she is one. Yeah, me too. But I guess that's some Moses shit for you. I don't think it's just that she discovered she is one. I think it's also because she discovered that, like, what she thought, like, what she thought she was doing was putting them into, like, a, putting them in, like, I don't know, work or punishment, and instead they were being murdered. I guess it kind of reflects kind of what happened in Germany, where a lot of people are like, "Oh, they're just you like never going." Told me what happened here while I was gone? It's yeah, a long and they're just going story. to work camps, and you're like, "But that's bad sure too." Mm -hmm. I want to know what happened. It all went very fast. After our talk at the plant, I ran to the service track we used and drove back. I arrived here expecting the worst, but everyone was fine. I was in the middle of delivering my report when I heard an explosion, and Banku himself came through the roof on a mining lift. He was here? In person? Are you sure you want to hear the end of this? Of course. Tell me everything. Well, Banku broke through the roof. Validated forgotlings were everywhere. They set fire to the linen, and before I knew it, everything burned. Banku was distilling everyone crossed his path. I decided to hide the survivors in the memorial. There, we sat. Just waiting for him. And of course, he found us. I got up, and I looked him in the eye. Then he yelled, Where is she? But before I could answer, the light faded around me. No pain, just darkness creeping in from all sides. The next thing I know, the light returned. And there you are. 
I'm sorry you had to go through that. We have to stop him. We will. Okay, so when I get close to the crystals, my Arca charges. So I just have to get close to him. And then I can save everybody down here. Where am I? You're back. Thank you. Okay. Where? I, I was dead? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Well... I just need to find another crystal. I think there was another one down here. Where yeah, she there was, was that like... big one. Right? Yeah, right here. We gotta save Jinx. She's my girl. I love it. And I love that she is a... <gasps> what happened? I'm returning the favor. Thank you, Anne. I like, you know, I was kind of being like, I hope we don't have to do a conversation about why they're alive each time. But now I'm like, oh, everyone's just like gonna accept that? Alright. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Nothing. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Don't think about it. Deal with it later. Emotionally. I save the night. That's a little more than what I was going for. Thank you, Enforcer, ma'am. Maybe we should change your name. To something other than enforcer. <laughs> yeah. Uh, maybe we should like the you know our next plan of action is not to have the name enforcer. That might be a good idea. I mean, it's just you know it has that little fascist ring to it. <laughs> yeah. Wait, ma'am, what are you enforcing now? Yeah. Oh, uh, friendship. Uh, okay. <laughs> Can we have a different name, please? Enforcer of justice. Enforcer of friendship. Even, yeah, like, even Enforcer of Justice, I feel like, has... Yeah, maybe you shouldn't call it that. That's... I think Enforcer... <laughs> the Mannequin Fucker says Cosmorian. I like that one. I'm Mannequin Fucker Anne. I... Okay. Ooh, yeah. it looks like there's a little baby down there. We gotta go get him. Can barely see him. It's over for now. Thank you so much. It's over. Don't talk it's about over. your feelings. Don't, don't worry about it. Don't fucking deal with your emotions or do it with somebody else. I don't know. You are my savior. Well, I don't know about that. Truly an honorable deed. I am forever grateful. Yes, now I have an army of people who will never betray me because they owe me their lives. <laughs> That's how I'm supposed to, to, like, perceive this, right? <laughs> so would their ship name be Anakin? And I know exactly <gasps> how we can take Anakin down with one swift blow. All right, <coughs> let's do this. I look forward to hearing your thoughts, sir. Can't wait. Recently, I spoke to a forgotling with insight into the tower grounds. I've crafted a plan based on the information he gave me. Who was this Forgotling, and where is he now? I'm afraid I haven't seen him after the attack. What was his name? It was none other than the great Crate Boxton. <laughs> Who is this unsung hero? Boxton. The bravest Forgotling I've ever met. Uh, Bob? It was me in disguise. I'm Crate Boxton. What? <laughs> he wanted to get the Arca back. That can't be right. It's oh. true. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Remember? It was you. You tricked me. I am sorry about that, Bulb. But I have a suggestion. A plan? <coughs> yes. Here's my plan. We simply walk in. Through the main gate? Bonku sealed that a long time ago. There's a secret entrance in my house, though. I knew so it. we're not simply Dilly walking right. in. You still need to get past the checkpoints at the central station and tower grounds. We'll pretend I've caught Fig. Everyone will think I was on Bonku's side all along. That's quite a gamble. It'll work. The secret tower entrance in my house is protected with an Arca lock. I can't open it alone. I'll go with you. Maybe the two of you can sneak in, but you'll need backup in case something goes wrong. He's right. Let me round up my friends from Scrappers. Once Fig and I are inside the tower, we can turn off Bonku's security systems, and then the road will be clear for Bulb and his friends. 
When we see the security system is off, we blow a hole in the wall and storm in. All right, but I want to speak to Banku before you do anything, Bulb. I have to convince him not to activate the ether bridge. Anne is right. Fiscal confrontation is our last resort. Did you hear that, Bulb? Yes, yes, fine. Now that's positive thinking. I'm sure it'll work. I wish you the very best of luck. The journey is dangerous. The town will be occupied by forgotlings loyal to Bonku. Not to mention lost pieces. What about the thing up in the top of the tower? That's just a story. There's nothing living in the tower except Bonku. Let's not start with the ghost stories. I think we all deserve a good night's sleep before we leave tomorrow. And you can rest at my place. <laughs> oh. oh, we can rest at your place? Let's go. Okay. Go ahead and take a rest there. Wait, are you coming with? Where we? Did you see the enforcer earlier? She can summon forgotten back to life. That's crazy. Is that a good thing or a bad thing, I wonder? Should anybody have that kind of power? What if she turns on us? Good evening, Anne. The bed is ready for you. You must be tired. I am. Thank you, Blanket. Good night. Sweet dreams, Anne. We just napped for like five... Okay, whatever. No, that's different. That's mystical napping Blanket? in a boat. Oh, mm -hmm. true. That's not real. Like, she didn't actually it's sleep. Kind it was of mystical like, now. It's kind of like when you sleep on the floor at one of those, like, sleepover slumber party things, and then, like, you're not really rested because you were sleeping on the fucking floor. <laughs> yeah, and the next day your mom's like, are you ready to go to soccer practice? And I'm like, absolutely not. Absolutely fucking not, What do you mom. remember from your life in the ether? It's a strange thing. You don't remember your life up there until you arrive here. What do you mean? I remember being there. I remember being wrapped around you. I remember your mother. But I was not really there. Oh. I'm the luckiest forgotling here, you know. I'm already with my owner. I like that. Me too. <sighs> See you tomorrow, Blanket. Good night, Anne. I cannot believe I have to adjust this again. You are growing so fast. I want to be this big! Oh, you will. Just one more adjustment, and your Arca is ready again. Why do I have to wear that? Because you are very, very special, Anne. We'll always be together, right? Of course. Time to get up, Blanket. Oh no, is it gonna be a Blanket. crystal? <gasps> Blanket, Blanket, you better not have crystallized. Morning, Nan. Ready to go? What's wrong? Oh. Are you alright? No. No. I am not going to be okay. <laughs> Why did this have to happen? She was old. It was her time. I had such a good talk with her last night. About the ether. I'll have someone move her to the memorial. Thank you. No, I'm bringing Blanket with, well, even if she's a huge rock then. now. <laughs> this is not okay. Wow, I'm so glad we got to have this, like, nice, lovely conversation. Oh, good morning, Blanket. No! Yeah, like, you what? You spent how many years not a cuddling with Blanket? You get one night of a Blanket cuddle and she's dead? Well, fuck this game. It's like you finally find out the significance and, like, who she is. I bet Blanket was following us around the whole game, like, maybe today she'll pet me like a yeah. sad dog. I hate this. I'm so sad right now. Over here, Anne. We'll take this lift up. I just thought about sad dogs, and I'm gonna be we'll like emotionally wrecked for the rest of the day. <laughs> Once we turn off Bunker's security system, they'll blow the tower ground wall. Which way do you suggest we take? Uh, if we want to keep out of Bunker. No, yeah, see, see, he's like crying about the blanket. No, I'm no, laughing at you. Don't laugh at me and my sadness about the blanket. 
No, it's not about because because you were like, I just thought about sad dogs. Yeah, I'm thinking about how sad dogs are right now. Why are, why are dogs sad? Because a lot of people had to give up their dog like recently, and yeah. so there's like people being like, Hey, can you foster these dogs? Because <laughs> nobody can afford their dogs. I feel like in a couple months, somebody was talking about this on Twitter, all the dogs are going to have separation anxiety because everyone's home right here. now. Yeah. Let's go. At least I have Fig to be my boyfriend. To like one arm throw me very strongly, very sexily. I like that. <laughs> Lost pieces. I have Wait, have you considered not doing that? We have to... Are we pal... Are we opening the door? Is that what we're doing? Hold on. I have an idea. get the lost pieces to help me. Oh, okay. Oh, I need to get him to move it to the left. The lever's not powered. Oh, okay, hold on. <clears throat> okay, I'm gonna figure this out. I gotta grab this. attacking me but now I can't use it but I want him to move it to the left, left. light on and I can't move well I can't hmm Turn off the did you turn off the power? Yeah, I turned off the power to everything, so I should turn this back on. But now I can move with these dudes on me. But then they don't. Can you? At least I have them on the 
right side now. What do you want me to do? I'm no, I'm, I'm So I want these dudes to be on here. Mm -hmm. And if I put these up here, then I can't open the door. Oh, maybe hold on. Okay, they'll stop attacking me, but I want them to stay over here. I'm hoping I can get them trapped behind the light. They all get shoved back to the right, so I guess they anticipated that. Let's. The lever's not powered. If you shut it off, then they'll come to you. That's a good idea. And then they come over here. Mm -hmm. And then I turn it back on. I walk past. They can't get past. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then cut the... still some on me. Great. Yeah. some way to make them stay there. I can't figure out how to I make wonder, them do that. I wonder if it's like... Here, here's a question. Can you... So now they're all stuck over yep, there. So now put your power above the thing. And, and that'll draw them above it. Ah, okay. So I gotta tell them to come over here. That's a good idea. Let's hope. Maybe will this work? Yes, I think it will. Please work. <gasps> Are there just not enough of them? Like I. Okay. Maybe he has to collect them all. Right. Did we have to? 
we not open the floor there? I don't know. No, it's there. They're supposed to jump up and down. Oh, wait. Is what? this on? Yes, it is. It is on. to the trolley. Okay, and that's gonna so, open the door and make him attack me. Ugh. So now they're all on me. The f they're just like, I don't understand. Yeah. I'm not like a huge fan of puzzles. What are we supposed to do? Like, that's... I don't know. There was more at the beginning, but they, they were launched to the right during your testing, so you're missing some. You had the idea in the end, but you lost too many. At least that's my theory, says Kitty Meow Meow Cat. But it, here's the question, then. Wouldn't we be, like, stuck? Yes. Well... <laughs> but we, I suppose... I guess that doesn't really matter at this point. our only option is to try to restart it. What do yeah. you think? I was going to try to... Oh, the, yeah, there was a big piece you had, but it's gone out. So where... Did... It just bugged out, I guess. Yeah. That seems kind of stupid. Well, it's an indie game, so yeah. what are we gonna do? Oh, like, at least it like puts us like right here to this puzzle, so. Yeah, unlike other times where it's like, would you like to start at the beginning of everything? I'm like, no. I sense lost pieces. answer at least. Mm -hmm. 
I guess. Wow. See ya! <laughs> I'm out of here. Bye. Somehow he's gonna make it through. I don't know how. Ooh, yeah, I what? <laughs> how come he can jump around and we like. Wow, he's got super wood, wood super powers. Jumping. Hey, we can like bring people back from the dead, like Jesus, and he That's can jump true. high, so I feel like it's fair. It's all chaos. Bunko made an appearance at the square. I heard the rabbit keepers at the fig been dispelled. Oh, listen. Fig pops in like reports of my death have been greatly exaggerated. I've been here before. Or you can An say. An engineer called Daisy lives here. She was designing a rocket last time I spoke to her. Come on, there's an exit at the top of the staircase. There's also the classic Commander Shepard line where said, I thought you were dead. Here. And she says, I, I got Bonica better. <laughs> That's <laughs> what she says, I rocket. got better. <laughs> Which is true. All right, how did you get up there? I got better. And then she, I think she shoots them or something? I can't remember. The rocket is gone. <laughs> I guess she finally launched it. Flying to the ether. Is that even possible? I guess we'll never know. And now we have to find another way to get out. What's that? Han! Lost pieces! Han! I can't move! Get off me, freak! Help me, Han! I can't! Bob? What's happening, Han? Oh. They're helping us! I hope. Whoa. Whoa! All the dead body parts. Thank you! <laughs> Why are you them? They almost devoured us. Don't you see? They're not lost pieces anymore. Well, how nice for them. <laughs> Bye! Take care! All I... right, can we move on now, please? I don't know. Fig is probably mad, At but also... At least we're safe now. Let's hope they find some peace. You have some powerful friends, Anne. I'm not sure. It must have been the caretaker. <laughs> Remember the last time we were here? Don't remind me. It wasn't that long ago. Feels like another life. Come on, follow me. Before we fell in love. If you think you can convince me otherwise, you haven't met a belt before. There are rebels and rebels are... We're freedom fighters. I want you off the streets. Who cares what you want? Yeah, you don't fool us. Sounds like you've been hit on the head a few too many times. All I want is to get back to the ether, feel a foot again. All you want is to destroy my dream. And that's all it is. A dream. Take that back. Or... Or what? Or... Or I'll just steal you. You think this isn't a real depleter? He'll do it. <laughs> You're a forgotten boot. A single boot. Your owner probably dumped you in a trash pile. Don't talk that way about my owner. No one cares about your owner. Oh my god! Yeah, keep going. We sure show them. Stupid, useless rebel. What a pointless loss. That was me. That boot. Was me. Not a boot licker? I was the boot. Come on. We need to move on. No, she was the boot. I just have to find a way down there. I can bring her back, Fig. Are you ready to distill two forgotlings to revive one? You're right. We better move on then. What? No, right, but I'm saying she so wasn't sucking up to authority. She was Getting the inside the tower is not a problem. There's a secret entrance from my house. We still need to get past security at two stations. Not to mention that lunatic gun forgotling. Chief Inspector Magnum, I can handle him. We'll pretend you're my prisoner, and he'll let us in. No questions asked. Of course. The gun nut will just let us straight through. Will you trust me for once? I think you owe me that. All right. Fill me in on the details, please. If I told you now, you'd refuse to go. Very encouraging. <laughs> so, Open my headcanon is that that forgotten wine opener, their owner got sober. Yay! But all oh, sad for the wine opener. Yeah. Right behind but... You. You heard it here first. Getting sober hurts people. Move it. I want to see you. Just flop. And he walked but away, just like, ah, oh, you're fine. Go back to your room now. <laughs> He's 
give a sh- Look at him! Climb away, not giving a single F. Wait, how am I supposed to get up? Hello? I don't- Dude. Maybe I have to- Oh, I see. <laughs> okay. Alright, fine. Whatever, dick. <coughs> She inspired us. She didn't distill the shoe or mop. I guess she didn't distill any forgotlings. Now I think about it. Stop being such a painted. That distiller has driven you mad with power. Excuse me. That walkie-talkie got what he deserved. Quiet. What do you think about this walkie-talkie business? You could influence it, you know. I think I have an idea. I can revive that walkie-talkie if you want me to. Whoa. <laughs> Maybe that's not such a great idea now I think about it. She can't revive me. The Arca doesn't work that way. It does now. If that's true, maybe we shouldn't revive him. After all, he did distill one of our own. I'll revive him no matter what you say. <laughs> <laughs> Don't tell me who I can Jesus. <laughs> I wish I could have saved the other one, but the other one costs like life. Wait! Oh my god! I'm not sure. Let's go. I don't know how to deal with this. Oh my god. <laughs> what the fuck? I kind of like the game just being like. You this is you're... so fucking savage. It's not a joke. You think you're gonna do the right thing? Fuck you. And also, it's like with cute little like mad. creatures. He's just not everyone he meets. Ever since he heard the important switch sides. Jump! I don't think I can make that jump. Yeah, we can. We do it all Come the time. On, you can do it. Just aim for my hand. <laughs> Fuck it! <sighs> About that, isn't it about time you explain the details? The plan is, we jump down there and I distill you. What? <gasps> we pretend that I went undercover to catch you. And to prove that I'm really on Banku's side, I distill you in front of everyone. I was distilled once and that's more than enough. <laughs> Let's just pretend that- Magnum needs to see me distill you. He has no clue that I can bring you back now. I'll revive you as soon as we're on board the train to the tower. You promise? I trusted you with my life once. Wow. You? What do you I... We jump down in front of everyone, and I say something like, Mr. Fig, I finally found you. Prepare to be distilled. And you say, Stay your hand. The darkness of your Arca shall never reach my soul. Oh. Long live the freedom fighters. <laughs> They're gonna yes, RP exactly. this so much I when they fuck. I know. <laughs> it's gonna call really? it be distill play. So. Maybe, maybe <laughs> like she can like then half distill, distill him, like edging. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's it's like to... choking, but <laughs> yeah. more. <laughs> Have you guys heard of distill play? It's where you just <laughs> it's better than choking. <laughs> Is choking just not quite enough for you? 
What if you? What if your girlfriend Someone's just fucking there. killed you Dumbo. and brought you back to life? <laughs> <laughs> My idea is to murder you. How is this possible? I finally have you, Mr. Fig. I feel like we're doing some real art. Well, I right feel now. like that's not it or shouldn't we huh. It doesn't matter? Yeah. Mr. Fig, at last I have you! Your rebel leader days are over! Prepare to be distilled by me. Oh, had I but known that the Enforcer was on an undercover mission for Bonku and never was on my side after all! She sure fooled me. <laughs> the end has come for you, Mr. Fig. I will now. So, this is how it ends. The terminus of my life has arrived, taking the form of an adolescent damsel. <laughs> Observe how the Lady of Anima prepares <coughs> my inescapable doom. Fig, what are you doing? I have arrived at my day's cataclysmic conclusion. I love how he literally cannot d even die without being yeah, dramatic. Yeah, being dramatic about it. Indeed, you have. And now you will... Oh, if only you knew what I have seen with these. My eyes. What I have felt with these. My hands. What I have smelled with these. My nostrils. <laughs> Never again shall I perceive any sensation of the... No, you shall not! Because I'm distilling you now. What will be after the Anima Sectami? What will I become? To which destiny have my feet taken me? All right, he can't. No more theater kid. I knew you'd never switch sides. This was your plan. I told you, didn't I tell you? What a plan. What a scheme. What a talent. Bravo, Enforcer. Thank you. It's good to be back. <laughs> Something not right. You're right. We have to celebrate. No need. Everything is fine the way it is. The rebel leader was finally caught by me, the Enforcer. Let me just get him on the train to the tower, and you can all go about your business. Yes, let's get on the train. Plum bum, seal, big and box. Yes, sealing that no good wooden traitor. Get him on the train. Just a moment. Endorser, have not worry at all. We can trust Plum bum with this, Madam Endorser. Uh, Madam Enforcer. Allow me to escort you. That wasn't part of the plan. I never imagined that my first time in the VIP lounge would be in your company, Madam Enforcer. Such oh my an god, honor. Oh, Jesus. No. It's over here. Uh, um, uh, whoa. Uh-oh. Uh. Oh, shit. <laughs> wow, at least we get to go in the VIP lounge. Hell yeah, VIP benefits. Ooh, look at all that. Yeah, give me that. Oh, wait, I'm already full of the life of the my husband. I better not, like, use it for useless shit. <laughs> Fantastic carriage, isn't it? Master Bunku had it made for his trips into town. Doesn't get any better than this. I can't remember the last time I felt this calm. No rebel can reach us here. You sure can't. You said no rebel could reach us here, right? That's right. We're completely safe. What, with you here? And me, of course. And me? Suppose a rebel did strike. What would you do? Well, I would hurry out of this lounge and conduct a good old search and destroy with them. I see. <laughs> so I'll just sit here. Madam Enforcer, Imp and Plumbug can take care of everything. Just stay in here and relax. Absolutely not. I'm gonna go hang out my, with the box. Pig's outside. How do I get to him unnoticed? Ah, uh, smell the victory. You sure showed the puny rebels his boss. Yes, it certainly did. The rebels are cunning, I'll admit that. Their very own eye in the sky proved to be more cunning by far. I didn't do it alone. 
you a team, remember? I know that my work is... that I have to be a part of this historic days. Thank you. Well, why don't we move into the... Imagine that rebel leader. Life is in a dark box like you think he is. Let's go inside. I can't tell you how great it feels to finally get rid of these pesky rebels. I bet you planned this all that morning when I was broken to your house. But before that... Well, I bet it was in you. A plan like this needs to be thought out carefully. You succeeded. The fire of the rebels has been extinguished forever. There's stairs right here, can, and I can't go up and down them, so whatever. Well, that guy's. You go down these stairs. Yeah. yeah. The other guy's just gonna distract everybody. Let's see. Maybe I can get the, these dudes stuck down here? Not here. And torture in VIP lunch. Okay. So, we have to do some type of distraction. Maybe I can, like, lure somebody in here? In B -I -E lunch. What happened to Red Scarf Husband from the beginning? I don't know. First came Metal Husband, not Wooden Husband, and the rest of the Elemental Husbands had. <laughs> Elemental Husbands, I love that. Held by a vengeful spirit with the wrong job. Ooh, I can like actually know who people. Okay, I get it now. Hold on. Dropped into a manhole covered by a surprised officer on his first day. Oh, I shouldn't distill this for darling. Now we can finally understand these people. Maybe this will be useful. Hold on. Only gasoline pump at a dusty countryside stuck truck stop. Not here. And torture in VIP lunch. I wonder if knowing his true spirit is helpful. No, it doesn't help. The last husband bender. Does anyone have any hints? I don't know what to do. And I don't know how to go down these stairs. Help. Fire Prince from Adventure Time is Fire Husband? Yes. Now you can read them. 
Hi, Elizabeth Wolf. I'm gonna look up how to do this. Forgotten Anne walkthrough. Uh, Excuse me. <laughs> I still haven't figured it out. Oh! But now I can look at people's inner inner like souls and figure out who how they were lost. And one of them was vengeful soul with in with wrong job, and that was um, the gun. Now I'm in the right spot. Hold on, let me look. Let's see what they do. What? How did you lure him over there though? Maybe you have to do that thing where you, like, tickle him? I don't know. Fig is trapped in that box outside to still as a door... Doornail. <laughs> Magda will not stop talking, and the temptation to use my Arca on him is getting hard to fight. Perhaps I can use the Arca for something slightly more discreet. I wonder what machinery Bonku has built into this lounge of his. First distill play now, tickle play. <laughs> See what this lady does. What does she do? I would like to post a link to a survey. Yeah, you can link it if it's for school. I think it's because, did I walk out of that conversation to, oh wait, what's this? Okay, I thought maybe. We were supposed to, maybe we're supposed to listen to this whole ass conversation. Whoops. Oh wait, no, I need to to distract those snoopers. Okay, so they look at the thing. So what's the, talk to the chat while I figure this out. I don't want them to get bored. Oh, you assumed it, they assumed it meant he was a criminal's gun. Oh, I thought it meant, oh, hold on. Let me just put my husband's soul into that real quick. Hold on. It's fine. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, they're attacking. Em, we gotta get downstairs. Get them. Catch them. Steal them. One of us should stay with you, Madam Enforcer. Who do you prefer, me or Em? Um. You, Chief Inspector Magnum, of course. Well, you better, Em. Get a move on, you lousy bullhorn. Yes, sir. But now I can look at people's souls and see where they came from. You gotta do everything yourself, Madam Enforcer. Please, just take a seat. I'll do with this. All right. <laughs> but I also used my husband's soul to overload this. Does it just not matter? Can I just... Deputy? Yes, it's just me. What's wrong? I'm trapped, but I'm all right. I'll get you out later. I have to look for the rebels. <laughs> Out of here. Let you be a big trunk. Yes, me. 
<laughs> oh, but look, so... Only gasoline pump at dusty old countryside truck stop. Held by vengeful spirit with, with the wrong job. Hmm. Basically saying that... Bad cop. Anyway, hey! You wanna wake Come up back, inside of a box? This has to be the worst He's way like, to wake up. Am I in a box? Am I in a box? Pig! It's so great to hear your voice again. Never mind my voice. Get me out. Well, I have good news and bad news. Of course you do. The good news is that you're alive again. That part of the plan worked perfectly. Wonderful. The bad news is that Magnum, Amp, and that big brute Plumbum are on the train with us. Never mind. T-Man and Fig can solve that. Just let me out. Well... That's the bad news, isn't it? Plumbum put a huge cargo box on top of you. It's too big for me to move. You're gonna leave me in this box? Once we reach the station, I'll get you out. I promise. Then why did you revive me now? You could have just waited. Oh. I didn't think of that. I'm so sorry. I guess it would have been better to wait. Will you be all right? Just do what you have to do. See you soon, Fig. Maybe Fig is kind of getting over it. <laughs> He's like, maybe I don't like you. <laughs> maybe I made a mistake. Uh-oh. Oh my god. Did you spot the rebels, madam? Yes. Sorry, I saw no rebels anywhere. Sneaky rebel waste. <laughs> we'll get them sooner or later. I'll promise you that. Here we are, Tower Ground Station. Let's unload that Jack and Ape in a box. <laughs> Jack and Ape. Tower Ground Station. I need to get to the tower as soon as I'm the station master now, and I don't have to take orders from you. Don't you recognize the Great Enforcer? Oh, is that so? Master Bunku personally informed me that your Great Enforcer aided the rebels in their attack on the plant. Oh, whatever it was, I'm sure it was part of a cover story. She destroyed the entire plant! You really want me to believe that? You think the Enforcer would have lied to me this whole time? <laughs> Taking advantage of my pro professional admiration of her? <laughs> we have a witness and mirror documentation placing the Enforcer at the scene at what turned out to be the most serious rebel attack in realm history. Oh. I'm sure the Enforcer can explain. Well, it's clear that... The problem here is... In fact, the explanation is straightforward. Oh. How can I trust anything you say, Secti? No one officially appointed you Station Master. But after Pax was gone, I assumed... Oh. How dare you question my loyalty to Master Banku? Oh. Well, uh... Officer Magnum, please escort Secti to the Central Station and question him so we can uncover the source of his betrayal. I'll make sure you receive a promotion. A promotion? But I'm already Chief Inspector. I'm sure we can find a title better fitting for your stunning talent and wit. Oh, that would be a dream come true, Madam Enforcer. I'll question Secti right away. You've always been my most trusted officer. Thank you, Madam. Right away, Madam. We'll get to the bottom of this. Come along, Secti. But, Madam Enforcer. Quiet. <coughs> all we have to do is pit them all against each other. And use their innocence against themselves. Uh -huh. Aww, little babies. Okay, I'm trying to go down the stairs, maybe? I know, I just, it's annoying when I'm trying to, like, move and stuff, and it's like, why don't I pause all movement and tell you things? It annoys me.
Is that Space Core? <laughs> oh my god, actually, maybe. Ah. <laughs> what? what? Wait. <laughs> Wait. Hold on. Where am I going? Did we leave him behind? <laughs> I don't, oh, there he is. He's in that box. Oh, okay. But I... Okay. Well, Wait. we just went past it. I don't know what to do. Oh, okay. We can just, like, run back. Oh, my God. <laughs> I, all I did was sit down and we just... Something... By Sage of Brioche says, out of interest, has anyone played Dust? It has similar animation quality to this, but the platforming is much more solid. <laughs> Open up! He's over there. How do I... Huh. Maybe I have to, like, go all the way back and go through all those puzzles to get him. No. Well... Sorry. That seems... Well, I have no choice now, so I guess... Huh. Can we... Which box is he in? He's in the one to the left. to the right of the tracks? The place where we came out? That's a good question. Who's out there? The tower is off limits. It's me, Tiffany. Anne? Hey, Tip. Would you open the gate, please? Anne? Master Bonku locked himself in his tower. I tried to call him on the mirror, but something cut the transmission. I don't know what to believe. First, I heard you went over to the Rebels' side. Then I heard it was all an undercover mission. I've known you my whole life, Anne. You owe me the truth. Which is it? I don't agree with Bonku's methods anymore. Anne? It's a long story, Tiff. How could you do this? I'm trying to find a peaceful solution. We're not here to distill anyone. We? Look, Tiffany, I... I don't care, Anne. You've made your choice. I need to get through, Tiff. It's important. Why should I help you? I need to speak to Banku. How could you turn your back on everything he's done for us? A lot has happened. If you'd seen what I've seen, the plant was not what we thought it was. I don't care about the plants. I care about you. The work lamp of a best-selling novelist from the Roaring Twenties. Tiffany Lamp. Oh. Um, please don't. I'm not opening the gate, Anne. You're a rebel now. Are labels like that really necessary? You even talk like a rebel. I need to speak to Banku. What do you think Master Banku would do to me if I let you in? I know you're scared. I'm scared too. Help me convince Banku to stop this madness. He attacked innocent forgotlings. They broke into your home. They sabotaged the pumping station. And what did they say to win you over? <sighs> Tiffany, please don't do this. I need you to open the gate. If you don't, I I'll have to. I've got to. Say it. You'll distill me, right? Like our friendship never meant anything to you. I wasn't gonna say that. Because you're a rebel now. Rebels are peaceful and enlightened, right? 
you're not being fair. None of this is fair, Anne. That better not be my only option right now. I mean, the good... The only good news is that we could bring her back if we wanted to. How would I even open the gate, anyway? I think... I don't know. Ed, are you out there? Big? There's a distilled forgotten in here. Just open the gate, please. Do you know this girl? Her name was Tiffany. She was my friend. Did you distill her? Come on, Fig. We have a lot to do. What did you do to me? What's going on? What do you want, Anne? Can't you just leave me alone? Bye, Tiffany. I love how he shows up, like, wow. one second after, after you murder someone. Yeah, thanks. Great. I love it. I don't love it at all. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tiffany. Wait, can we say one last thing, or she's just going to tell us to fuck off? Yeah, just, just fuck off. Wait, now we can do the thing to our husband, dude. Stop moving. Created for both art and comp and companionship by a traveling actress and her daughter. Okay. Hmm. Companionship, eh? And... I used to come here every day. <laughs> Is that what it we're calling it now? Yeah. now? I've known Tiffany my whole life. Sometimes you just grow apart. That's no reason to give up on a friend. You didn't give up on me. Why can't we explain the plant was a death factory? I don't know, for drama, so that we can kill our best friend yeah, for it's no like, reason. It's like that whole thing where, like, this is all a misunderstanding, and if we just fucking explained ourselves. But would Tiffany have believed us? That's the question. I don't know. But, like, why, why not even try? I don't know. Drama. Oh, no, there's impenetrable red tape. I can't get past it. Not red, not... Oh, wait, what's... Hmm? Oh, doesn't do anything. There's, a, there's a ladder over there, I think. Because you're not a friend, Fig. We're married. Oh, oh of course. Oh. Beep, 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 beep. Whee! We'll meet up ahead. Yeah, fine. The way you creepily want to go up those walls, dude, it's a lot. Mm -hmm. Girl's a cop, so she has no choice to obey. <laughs> we need your help. Report to the workshop and join us today. Oh, God. Just gonna. Uh, Let me take care of this. No, that didn't do it. Maybe there's a switch somewhere. to suck it out. We go back down to the bottom so we can take the elevator. Yeah. <laughs> Instead of just climbing what clearly is a ladder. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> but the way is blocked. No, we can just take that tape down. Ooh. 
if they had just Tiffany not believe us, that would have been much better writing. Still a bit forced, but at least they had a ch character try. I hate this trope. Oh, I'm sorry. It's blocked. What? No, it's not. It's like... It's literally right here. Uh, okay, so... Maybe I had to make the thing go up or something. Yeah. There he goes! There's just so many reasons that those are so big. <laughs> I see what the issue was. Okay. Ah. Uh, I had to move it down so I could climb the ladder so uh, it wouldn't block the way to get up. Nope. Anne? <laughs> Finally, I get to see your home. Um. Oh, yeah, I guess so. This is my house. Bunker must have cut the flow from his anima reserve. Well, this is nice. This is my dad. He's our fascist dictator. Space and what? Uh, three floors. And a balcony. Huh. Impressive. I'm not crazy about the neighborhood, though. Alright, he's gotten over the fact that we are a fascist and killed him several times. Mm -hmm. I think he's fine with it now. Oh, we can do the thing now. Because we have two peeps. Oh, we need some Arca, though. Hmm. Fig, could you help me here? Oh, you're right. We need to flip them at the same time. Ready? Three, two, one, go. Oh, shit. Uh. I'm sure there's some in the house. Hopefully. Nah, let's just kill Fig. It's fine. Again. Oh, no. <laughs> There's gotta be some Arca in the house. Maybe in the basement. Yeah. That, oh, yeah, we're, you're right. We found it before. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We had some, like, creepy amalgamation that we put in the basement. <laughs> Don't be mad, Fig. <gasps> They're all empty. Boo. <laughs> Oh gosh. Fig? I'm so sorry, babe. <laughs> You're gonna be real mad at me when I say this. But I'm gonna have to use your soul real quick to open this door. <laughs> Girl, I'm not gonna do it. I was just thinking um... about it. I did it. Um. I can, we can't even ask? There's gotta be- I'm gonna look around one more time, cause this, it can't just be like, fucking kill your boyfriend real quick. The other option is that switch thing, but I don't know if that would bring the elevator back. Or maybe- wait, we could- No, cause we need him to come back up. What if we- What if we- Press the button to brought the, bring the elevator up here. It's oh. blocked. <sighs> you know, I but think you're right. Yeah. Because he can't come up without power. Yeah. Woo, we didn't have to kill our boyfriend to open a door. Woo! Yay! <laughs> I think you're supposed to keep Tiffany's soul. No, no we figured no. it out. There were batteries right next to Tiffany. There was no reason to keep Tiffany's soul yeah. at all. <laughs> Whew. Thank the we'll Lord. We'll just barely make it through this without being a genocidal maniac. Oh my god. <laughs> but I like that there's an option to just real quick use your boyfriend's soul. <laughs> I wonder what the savage route is. If you can kill- Just killing everybody? Yeah. Because there's a lot of options to just 
be like a murderer. All right, we got to do the thing. Okay, everything is stuck. These three are on the right spot. Mm -hmm. Alright, this needs to... Here. Dude, let's go. I haven't been here for years. Hmm. Which way do we go? Up. Up it is. This is the core chamber. Banku taught me how to use the Arca to operate the service lifts. I used to play here. Uh, not exactly a safe playground. Banku didn't know, of course. Didn't used to be this cold in here. Looks different, too. The lifts will take us to Banku's private rooms. Before I got my own place, this is where I used to live. From there, we can access the control room and turn up the security system so Bulb can get in. What if Banku won't listen to reason? Then he'll turn on the ether bridge. But he'll listen. I know he will. Mm, but, well, I'm afraid I may have to face him alone. In Banku's eyes. You'll always be the one who turned me against him. Whatever you need, Anne. Aw. Support his boyfriend. leave that there for now because it seems like that might be important this is fun yeah this is neat kind of like oh. yeah this definitely uh, does not seem like a safe playground for a child but okay built all this shit, huh? Wow. <laughs> Bisexual Brioche says, dude's been killing millions and... and thinks he'll be reasonable. <laughs> he'll be reasonable if I just tell him to stop. Like, I don't know about that, Anne, but okay.
Back then, I thought it would be a power plant producing anima from crystals. And when you found out what it was? I knew I had to stop it. Not just the plant, Banku as well. I explained my thoughts to Rin, the supervisor of the plant, remember? How could I forget? We were pretty close back then. She ratted me out. Before I knew it, I was stripped of my validation sticker and had to escape the plant, chest over heels. Then what? I found a place on the ground, and a few like-minded forgottenings. Bob wanted your heart, but I was sure you'd join our side when you saw what you saw. That was risky. It was, didn't it? I guess we'll find out. See if this works. Wait, how are you planning to get from? Oh, see, bring that over there, and I can yeah. jump. And then I go down yeah. to my boyfriend. My boyfriend. Hold on. Well. F. Thank you for putting F in the chat. Thank you. Appreciate it. I love how that meme just never dies. Thanks a lot, Call of Duty, and your weird insensitivity to death. That was embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting pretty roasted in the chat. Leave me alone. <laughs> oh. Okay, last time I jumped and I overwinded, so I thought maybe if I just like don't jump. It'll be fine. <laughs> don't don't talk to me. <laughs> what if I just walked off the platform? I thought that would work because I jumped last time and I overdid it. Maybe you could. Yeah. I could what? No, no I, th I think you just, you know. At least it was easy to figure out what to do, even if the execution is whatever. I get so frustrated with the puzzles where you're... Oof. I did like a... So I was jumping and then I did a flip Backward backwards. Thing. Yeah, and I was like, yeah, there we go. Watch as I like fall off the last like inch right here. This is where I will fuck up. Guaranteed. All oh, right, it's right next to each other. We can't. You don't have up. to jump. Good. Meanwhile, Fig is watching. Like, God, what did I see in her? Honestly. Yeah. Dad, Dad, this is my new boyfriend. This was my home. Where's Bonku? Not here. He'll be at the atrium at the very top, with his ether bridge. Pretty photo. I'd stand on that balcony every night, close my eyes, and feel the rain on my face. I had no idea Banku took this photo. It's from the day I moved out. You know he got me a bike for my birthday once? It was this horrible old thing he found who knows where. But I loved that bike. He killed that bike. First time I rode it was in here. Mm -hmm. I knocked over a desk and two lamps. He, he killed that bike, you know, just saying. Like, if you think about it. Yeah. <laughs> he murdered that bike. Those are Bonko's first prototypes of my wheels. Bonko. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I got them for my 10th birthday. Well, can we grab them, or is that not it? I don't know. Maybe they wouldn't hold her if they were made for her when she was 10. 
This painting sucks, Bonku. Ba what if you won't listen to me? Take a look at this place, Anne. You're his whole life. You just need to remind him. So is everyone he she owns? So is everything she owns dead people? Yeah. It's yes. All of these things are dead. Things. I don't think so because I think that things can also Behind be created in this private world. Study. Out of what? Only things that have there. been forgotten. All of this is made of dead things. No, but then it would have crystallized. But not if they suck the soul out of them. I guess like, if you suck the soul out of something, you can. They don't crystallize. But like what? I I don't know. I just. I think that there was also a world full of things here, you know? From every rule that they've shown us, everything that comes here comes from the forgotten. I was never allowed in here. This is the place closest to the ether. Bonku went in here when he wanted to think and be alone. All these stories from the ether gathered in the same room. This must be the closest thing to the human world you can get without actually being there. Why didn't he let you in here? He never told me. It's a book titled Don Quixote. There's something written on the bookmark. A noble man convinces himself that he's a knight. Let's get out. Oof. Oof. Looks like I'm going to need some Arca charge. Oh. I don't. I won't eat it up yet. It's a book called The Prince. According to an attached note, it's about strategy regarding control of people by pl playing them against each other. <laughs> Jeez. Hmm. I wonder what this connects to. Well, I guess I can just take that thing then, because it's not important. Yeah. Just wanted to make sure I wasn't gonna like turn off a switch that, that you needed. Gonna... Yeah. Yeah. I do kind of like how she just like you don't fall and die; you just kind of flop on the ground. <laughs> supposed to go back there to the <sighs> platform or which platform I don't know how to get back there to be honest it seems like maybe in those library there... oh there's a yeah I see what you're saying yeah it's like three-dimensional though and layered. I don't yeah. know how to get over there maybe if I just like Oh. Yeah. Uh. This is the way to the atrium. It won't move. We have to shut down the security systems before we can go up. The door to the security room is in here somewhere. Okay. Peter Pan, there's a scribble on the cover. The boy refuses to grow up and leave his fantasy world. Hey, what's up? soul gets turned into objects, but an object can't just create its own soul. Ah. Here we are. You can shut off all the tower security systems from here. Depleters, gate controls, mirrors, you name it. Let's get to it. There's a bunch of switches. I'll take the one up there. Switch yet. Huh. Okay. What's to 
to the left. That's where we came up. Death. That's it. Death. So... Souls. It's all souls being like, I don't know. Oh. This seems like a very convoluted system, Dad. Yeah, well, he's bored, so. Let's hope we won't need it. Ooh. Bulb couldn't wait one second. Whoa. He was ready. He had yeah. his finger on the button. So it looks like we should go look out and see what happened. Is this... I can't drag this out any longer. Let's go. Oh, that was just wow. a... That was like a little... Let's look majestically into the sunset kind of situation. Oh, bro. What? Come on. Whatever, he's just gonna jump off yeah. and do something weird. Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> <laughs> he's like, yeah, you take your platform like a loser. <laughs> Shut up! Does that uh -oh. thing just move on its own? I think so. Oh. Ed, get out of here! What the fuck? What is that? We summoned the shadow of the Colossus. Tick tock, little man. What the fuck? What's your plan? What? Why does it sound like our voice? What the fuck did he do? Hang on, Fig. I'm on my way. Well, well, little Anne. Tick tock, tick tock. So far on your decline. No reason to be sad. It happens, it happens. We need to talk to Banku! Let us go! Why should we? Nothing matters. Tick tock. Fear or love, darkness or light. It all leads to neglect. Everybody is looking out for themselves. Useless for is blinded by your purpose. The master will activate Seed of Bridge. He will, he will power it with the Arca. And this world will crystallize. That's why we have to stop him! What happens, happens. Tick tock. Find your peace. You think you can keep me trapped in here? <laughs> Tick tock. It'll hold, little Anne. Stop it! If she, you it can hear her own voice in it. Wow. Tick tock. You must see that. Wake, Wake up, little Anne. Wake up. Wake up? What? Is this a dream? <gasps> Tink, is it you? Know that monster? It's not a monster. She used to be my alarm clock. That thing? She was smaller back then. Oh, Tink, what has he done to you? I am the his masterpiece. Hi, Marvelous Monk. I have seen him unlock the potential of Anima, tick tock, and tame the Arca. I witnessed him overcoming the laws of crystallization. Taught me how to tell time and woke me up every morning. I have evolved. I am no longer subject to forgotten weaknesses. The master gave me arms to turn the pages of his books. He connected me to platforms so I could lift him. I grew and grew. Today, I am the very tower all around me. One morning, you were just gone. 
I thought you crystallized. I cried for a week. Master, wanted me to be a secret. I am his final shield. I'm not his enemy. I'm his family. I've watched you grow up. I am one with the tower, the pipes, and the anima. I've always sensed you. Every time you've stood by a communications mirror, I've seen you. I've heard you. I know you, Anne. What have you become, Tink? I am connected to the Master. I cannot crystallize. Once the bridge opens, I am set free. No! We can't let him do it! I have to talk to him! Tick tock, why care? Everything you do leads to neglect. You are young and not aware of this. Time and tide wait for no one. Tick tock. Useless. No need to try, little man. Don't listen to her! She's on the road! Tell me how to deliver your And for what? Maybe I have to suck the soul out of her or something. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, at this point, yeah, maybe that's a good idea. Yeah, it just seems... Uh, not doing her best. Yeah. She's not living her best life, so I'm gonna suck the soul out of her. Don't worry about it. I know what I'm doing. Hmm. Okay. Okay, wait. If you, get, if you let go of the side and go down into it, does it move? Oh, that's a good idea. Let's see. Yep. You can change anything. Do you think you know what is right and wrong? Nothing is black or white. There is only black. Tick tock. Only oh. more darkness. Every time you forgive someone, you encourage, you encourage them, to them to betray you again. This sounds like the ramblings of somebody who's been in a torturous nightmare for 20 years. Yeah. You should never give up on anyone. You know I'm right. The truth hurts. The truth may hurt, but I'm done lying. Ed, could you stop the jabbering and help me? <laughs> <laughs> of course. Hang on, I'm on my way. Hmm. What 
do you think you're doing? Well done, Ed. Quick, grab my hand. Um, so, Dad, uh, you made a clock monster. Out of um, my childhood friend? Yeah. Can you, like, not do that? Oh. Oh, I see what he wanted me to do. Thank you. Now, would you please take care of your friend? That thing is making me nervous. Take care of me. You see, Anne? Everybody's looking out for themselves. What will you do now? Distill me? I can't distill you, Tink. There must be another way. To whom am I speaking now? Are you Anne the Rebel? Or are you the Anne I used to know? Tink. And we need to get going. If she won't move, make her. Are you hearing this? Everyone <coughs> is self-serving creatures, only looking out for themselves. Tick tock, let go of your morals and ethics. Ruin others, or you are ruined yourself. It's not true, Tink. And enough talking, let's go. I can't. Tink and I grew up together. Please understand. Fig. The slightest change off course, and I would have ended up like her. And she's not Tink anymore. I need to hear what she has to say. You will listen to me. I need to know more. And I want to help you. Tick tock. Tick tock. Tick -tock. Why? If I can understand you, then maybe. You think you can understand yourself through me? You're right. I haven't always been exemplary. Isn't it true that you only care about others when they're of use to you? No, that's not true. I'm not like that. <laughs> Such naive honesty. Oh, we're gonna show us I murdering people. Oh boy. I know how you think and feel. I've been following your journey. Every time you stood by a mirror, I've seen you. Seen you. I've heard you. Lend me your eyes, tick tock. Look at this. Let's try to match your words with your actions, shall we? Remember what you just said? You should never give up on anyone. Your words and actions don't add up. Who are you, Anne? Okay, but I can put her back to yeah. life, so... She was my friend. You just told me moments before. I can't distill you, Tink. There must be another way. From time to time, you act with compassion. Mr. Fig, as many call him, often hangs out at a bar downtown called Scrappers. You know, where they record Realm Radio. The old theater? Yeah, the entrance is in there. Here. Take this ticket. You could. You're right. I haven't always been exemplary. Well, yeah. <laughs> oh, really? What is this then? But I said we what haven't always. That? I guess we could live with that, as long as it's temporary. It's settled. Change the angle of the mirror, please. And when he comes down, you let him leave quietly. Deal. Agreed. You are a hypocrite, Anne. Wait, that's not fair. I'm not like that. I've changed. Haven't you noticed? Perhaps you conveniently overlooked that. I noticed a change, yes. But, but some, some stains are too big. Tick tock, too dark to overlook. You say one thing say one and do another. Do another. You never take that stand. You are hollow. I cannot let you through to the master. Tick tock, tear me apart. If that is my wish, go ahead. Why should I have a different ring? Oh, 
no. There's gotta be a better way. Yeah, I don't know. She just wants to die. Fair. Not the others. Neglect everyone around. Yeah, maybe she's. Maybe you can take her out, like, without killing her. Yeah. The Clockmaker's masterpiece kept from unworthy eyes by bitter retreat. Hmm. Previous choices were our only hope. I don't know. Yeah. I wonder how the choices would have been if we picked different options. I don't know. I don't like. I feel like we didn't go the shitty route. Uh, yeah, I feel like we tried our best. <laughs> yeah. How else were we supposed to do the Tiffany area? I know. Like, it really set us up for failure. <laughs> Like the situations that I, that she brought up, I feel like we. Baku is behind that gate. You're ready, Anne. Look, no matter what happens up there, I'll always be your friend. I will always be yours. See you around, Anne. I feel like Smooch. <laughs> I feel like those those particular things didn't weren't really choices as much as like you know. I don't know, maybe there were choices. I don't know. Yeah. <sighs> Gotta do this alone. Hey. Can we get a smooch? What's wrong? I'm not sure I can do this alone. I wanna see the weird smooch they'll have. Mm -hmm. You never had to. Okay. <laughs> Yay! Yay! I really wanna see a, a kiss between these two. I wanna see what that would be like. What, yeah, what's what? that gonna be? <laughs> Just, so is he, is he shorter than her or taller than her? I, hmm. We don't know. Because <laughs> his face is, you know? <laughs> this is, these are questions that need to be answered. What's that? That must be the cornerstone. Banku carved the Arca out of it. The caretaker spirit told me that Banku stole it. It seems to power the ether bridge. This is it. The ether bridge. This is what Bonku's been working on all these years. My boyfriend's back and you're gonna be in trouble. How do we break it? 
maybe use the thing? Oh, I can't. Oh, okay. We're gonna do initiate a boss fight. Give it up. Fig, let me do the talking. I, I got this, babe. What a nuisance. Okay, Anne. Oh, okay. You finally came. And you brought company. I thought you had the decency to come alone. You want my Arca, don't you? That's why you left me. I never left you. I'm here to beg you to stop the war against the Forgotlings. And to shut down the Aether Bridge. Fig's off this is not bad. war. Mm -hmm. It's the finish line. You expect me to throw everything away? Now? We could start over. Forget all this fighting and distilling. We could find each other again. We don't belong here. This is a land of forgotten things. Look around you. We're forgotten too. I've accepted that. It's time you did the same. <laughs> what about your mother, Anne? Don't you want to see her? Oh my god. He's a Let boomer. us return to the and find the answers together. You and I. I don't give a shit about you my mom. She left me in a river. You. With you and your Arca here, we just need to turn on the ether bridge and walk through it. That is all. Nothing more. This is what we've always wanted. It's what you've always wanted. Please don't turn it on. We cannot stop now, and Baku, please don't turn it on. Think of all the Forgotlings. They're just like you and me. No need to worry, Anne, dear. In a matter of minutes, our new life begins. Quick, break it! met the witch. And wake up. Do you not see we are living in her are fantasy we asleep? world? The this real is world is up there. The oceans, the forests, everything you have always wanted to see. Will you give all that up for silly cartoon characters? Our own kin awaits us. And we can finally go home. You and I. We're in someone's Could imagination. You leave without me? And I. <laughs> you... <laughs> it's me, you tuxedo mask. <laughs> Give me your arca. No, wait. Stay back. If you come any closer, I will distill you. I don't care anymore. Stand back. <laughs> oh my God. Get away. No, Bob. No, get him, Bob. Use the last of your life. Do what you need to do. Save yourself. Be the hero of your people. Again, no one can hold back the combined power of the ether bridge and the cornerstone now. The time has come for you to make a choice. You can go with Bonku and leave this land behind. It will undo everything you have come to know about this place and everyone here. Or you can return the Arca to the cornerstone. Returning our land to the way it was before your arrival. And you, 
will crystallize. So we sacrifice ourselves to save everyone we love. All right, how do I uh, break maybe, everything? Maybe just walk over there to You it. have two choices, and You can use the power of the Arca to fuel the ether bridge. That will open the tunnel to the human world. And you can leave with Bonku. Or you can use the Arca to restore the cornerstone and our land. If you stay here, you will crystallize. If you go, everything here will cease to exist. Wow. Yay, we're gonna die! Anne, you did it! You saved us. You better kiss me. Did. Yeah, for like. You could have saved yourself. It... I have to go. Give me a fucking oh, kiss. Wait. Yeah. Please. Will you help me get over to Funk? I'm sorry. I shouldn't have showed you the plant. Well, yeah, I you should have. I should have never have contacted you. I should have done this alone. Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> you could never have done this alone. I <laughs> <laughs> got him. <laughs> Sassy to the end. Right about that. Kiss. 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 Kiss in that weird way, or however you're gonna do that. I'm glad I met you. Goodbye, Dad. Did we just get friend zoned to death? Yep. I fucking hate that. Well, we're dying now, so we don't have to live with our shame for much longer. Oh my god. And why? Because you suck. The world has abandoned us, Master. I've let us down, Eddie. Master! Uh, ah! This could be us, but you crystallizing. What would you do if we kissed in the Arkham? <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what happens if we choose to go through the door. Yeah. Let's go back and find out. What'd you think of that? Summer, I liked it. I like that, like, in a revolution, you know, you gotta sacrifice yourself for the people. That kind of idea. Someone said in the chat, it's not a dream and something much more sad. What is it? We could kiss before crystallization, but unless... <laughs> It just ends like that? After credit scene? I hope so. I was hoping he'd realize the error of his ways. Oh well. I think he did. He said, you know, I failed us. Oh, see how Amelia Tyler and Jay Britton are a whole bunch of the voices in here? They were two of the voice actors from the Turing test. Oh. Do you remember they watched our video? And, because I remember we oh, talked to them. Oh, yeah. Anyway, yeah. Anne and Bonk who drank their bone hurting juice. There's an after credits too, I believe. Dude, is this like the dying hallucination of the baby? Is it like drowned in water or something? Well, hold on though. Did it... I don't like the idea of it. none of it being real. Because I hate that shit. Because then nothing mattered. I... So in my head canon, the baby doesn't die. The baby was forgotten. And then the, wi the witch takes mercy on the baby and brings it to the land of forgotten things rather than having it die. I think it's just like if you've forgotten you go there, human or not, it's just more likely that but, objects get forgotten. But there's no other humans there. Bonku was there and he, he was put himself there. He wished to be forgotten and he got forgotten so he went to the forgotten world. Right, but I just, only two people? I'm Ever? sure there's, I don't know. I don't know. It, it was interesting that he said, what, you would rather stay here for a bunch of cartoon characters? Mm -hmm. I thought that was interesting. And there were some other things that people said, like, you're going to stay here with, like, things that aren't real. So I was just wondering what that's all about. It's all determined by wave functions. Can we see a video of the end of the ending? Yeah, we can, we can go back to the last save point and see what happens. 
Yeah, I feel like there would be lots of other people if, yeah. if people weren't there, if they were forgotten. <laughs> Bridge unlocked. But we did the whole thing to not open it? The caretaker strives to treat everyone equally and peacefully, rarely seeking to influence the world. The caretaker observes life as it unfolds. Post-credit scene? Dear Anne, it's been a couple of weeks now. Everyone came. We carried your crystal down from the tower. Many still don't understand what happened. Some even think we're still going back to the ether. I miss you, Anne. So much that my joints hurt. Bro. I guess that's the cost of remembering. It hurts that only your memory is with us. But I would rather have it that way than to never have known you. Forever your friend, Vic. He friend zoned us in death. <laughs> Maybe him and Bolt were together. Vic, Maybe we were misreading Billy, that. How have you been? I haven't seen you in ages. What are you doing here? Oh, just reminiscing about old times. What have you been up to? Helping out with the renovations. But what are you doing now? Well, actually, it's supposed to be a surprise, but I guess I can reveal it now. We're so close to opening anyway. Opening what? What is it? We rebuilt the sanctuary. It's gonna be a library. We've moved all the books from the tower there. That sounds amazing! Big? Oh, T Tiffany, right? I I'm sorry. Our last meeting really wasn't... Oh, no need to mention that. Times have changed. What are you doing now? I'm conducting tours of the tower grounds. Many forgotlings have never seen them, you know? That sounds interesting. Someone has to pass on the knowledge, right? I might show up one day. Please do. I'd be happy to tell you all the stories. What are you oh, doing? Oh, they're sad we curse. the sanctuary into a library. Oh, that's a fantastic idea, Fig. Why does and that person always look to so see that very soon. <laughs> oh, sorry. I have to go. I've got a tall crowd waiting for me at the central station. It was nice to see you again, Fig. You too, Tiffany. Tag yourself. I'm sad purse that no matter what's happening, I'm just gonna sit there and be sad. Look at all these giant crystals. I, I assume a lot of people died. Yeah. I love how Bulb is never mentioned again. Oh gosh, she's right. <laughs> Basically saw her whole Forgotling family die and then died with her Forgotling dad in her arms. Also dying. <laughs> God. <laughs> no, it's fine. Oh, storylines. I wonder if I can just go back to right where we were. Hmm. And see. Oh. Nope. What does it say? Why does it say pre so when you did press X to enter the bridge, it just brought you to the beginning? No, I just did a continue. Let's see what happens if I can just do this. Hold on. What? What is this? What? what? Hold on. I In order to prevent timeline. Okay. As president of whatever, I give you the timeline bridge. The power of chrono calibration unit combined with my engine genius make it possible to travel to specific plot points in the past. Use the arc of panel to tune into whichever point you'd like, Cupcake. When you use this bridge, you create a new temporary timeline. 
You can experience this new timeline for as long as you like and come back and continue as often as you want. So, but beware. Yeah. Uh, whenever you use the time of your travel, all events from A that precede X will still have happened and a new timeline is created. You get that, right? P.S. Things you carry along with you will be kept in your inventory. Why grab, why grab needed that feature? I don't know. I don't understand what his deal is. Combination of an arc reactor and a stargate. Ooh. Baku is behind that gate. You're ready, yeah. Look, no matter what happens up there, I'll always be your friend. I will always I want be a yours. friend. See you around then. I want a boyfriend. to kill everybody to save ourselves. It was never real, blah, 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 blah. Let's go back to the real world where we're treated like shit. Where is he? This is it. The Ether Bridge. This is what Bonku's been working on all these years. Banku carved the Arca out of it. The caretaker spirit told me that Banku stole it. It seems to power the ether bridge. All right, let's see what happens when we're just a piece of shit. Yay! Banku, oh, she didn't have to yeah. Think. Let me do the talking. What a nuisance. Finally came. And you brought company. I thought you had the decency to come alone. You want my Arca, don't you? That's why you left me. I never left you. I'm here to beg you to stop the war against the Forgotlings and to shut down the Ether Bridge. This is not war, it's the finish line. You expect me to throw everything away now? Start over. Forget all this fighting and distilling. We can find each other again. We don't belong here. This is a land of forgotten things. Look around you. We're forgotten too. I've accepted that. It's time you did the same. What about your mother, Anne? Don't you want to see her? Let us return to the ether and find <laughs> the answers. Shane V28, that's a great emo. And I. Can't force people to remember you. With you and your Arca here, we just need to turn on the ether bridge and walk through it. That is all. Nothing more. This is what we've always wanted. It's what you've always wanted. Please don't turn it on. We cannot stop now, Anne. Baku, please don't turn it on. Think of all the forgotten links. 
They're just like you and me. No need to worry, Anne, dear. In a matter of minutes, our new life begins. <laughs> Without me? And I never got the chance to answer the question. He's like, I would. I, yes. Stay back. Come any closer, I will distill you. I don't care anymore. Stand back. Get away. the Arca Stones. Yes, I know. I can feel my old strength once again. No one can hold back the combined power of the Ether Bridge and the Cornerstone now. The time has come for you to make a choice. You can go with Bonku and leave this land behind. See ya. Do everything you have come to know about this place and everyone here. Or you can return the Arca to the Cornerstone, returning our land to the way it was before your arrival. And you will crystallize. Nah. Bye. Oh, wait. Let me say goodbye real quick. You have two choices, Anne. You can use the power of the Arca to fuel the Ether Bridge. That will open the tunnel to the human world. And you can leave with Bonku. Or you can use the Arca to restore the Cornerstone and our land. If you stay here, you will crystallize. If you go, everything here will cease to exist. Why can't Bonku see a light here? When you look in different directions, you will never share the same view. He is anchored in the past. Okay, well, bye. See ya. boyfriend fuck off you're dead uh -huh. don't forget about us oh my god what kind of fucked up shit are we gonna see
don't. Hospital? Anything. Literally throw the baby at someone. It just, like, I, anything but put it in a crate in a river? Wait. That... <laughs> okay. There better be a post credit scene. Nothing. That didn't explain. Yeah, we already went through the whole Anne is Somewhere Moses thing, but. Um, Anne's mom was such a drama queen. Yeah, like two people said, oh, I don't know. I, don't, I can't help you. And she's like, well, trying to put the baby in a river. She's like, you know what? I saw this great movie, Prince of Egypt. I have an idea. <laughs> I think she'll probably be picked up by rich people if I just throw her in the river. Yeah. Or, ma'am, have you seen... If I just throw have her you seen... in the river, she'll be, get, she'll be adopted by the royal family and raised to believe that, you know... Alternatively, ma'am, have you seen Bat Tim Burton's Batman where the baby gets thrown in a river and she turns into a fucking penguin? Yeah. Is there another post credit scene? I hope so. If you're watching this on YouTube, you can just fast forward to find out what the post credit scene is. Seems as if both endings we just die <laughs> horribly. I guess she was never forgotten now, so she never went to the other world. Yeah, so does she just die now? Does she just drown in the river? What's going on? That's what I was saying. She was rescued and brought to the forgotten world so that she wouldn't die. <laughs> and then we killed the forgotten world, and then the lady was like, well, fuck you too, then. Yeah, and the witch was like, you know what? Like, fuck off. <laughs> This one is arguably worse, you'll see. Oh shit. <laughs> Should we just be like some sort of picked up by some creep? It's just be like, and then it shows her a tombstone as a like a Jane Doe baby. Yeah. At least we get to see Blanket again. Maybe she'll go back to the Forgotten World and it's just an endless loop. Oh shit. Is it gonna just be like you die in both versions? The rebel is idealistic and com committed. Force is never a solution. The rebel acts in order to further understanding. Woo Woo Mania says, honestly, I wanted this end with Anne kissing Fig, marrying him, having Pinocchio kids, and living in the Forgotten World happily ever after. Yeah. Same. Why couldn't we have that? Are you fucking kidding? Are you for real? We're, we're right back here? Yeah. It is an endless loop. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. What's going on? Haha, <laughs> suckers, death is the only escape. Oh no. Are you for real right yeah, now? Yeah, this is just the beginning of the game. I wonder if it'll be any different. 